This building at 1428 and 1430 West Franklin Street is a survivor. After standing vacant and deteriorating for many years, it has been reborn as the Tin Man Brewing Company. The original portion of the building sits at the corner of 8th and Franklin. It is a three-story brick building painted dark gray with a navy blue hue. The facade contains 12 stacked sash windows. There are five stunning oculi openings along the upper portion. At the top of the building, there's a brick corbelled parapet and newly added exterior lights located above the third floor windows. During the renovation in 2012, a one-story addition was added to the east of the building to house part of the Tin Man Brewery. The five ocular openings on this one-story eastern portion were made to match the historic west half of the building. On the first floor, there are two canopies with four large windows and two doorways into the restaurant. On the service door of the Western Edition is a very large painted Tin Man logo designed to grab the attention of passers-by. This building was originally built in 1870 and served as a boarding house. Later in 1884, a saloon was opened on the bottom floor. In 1899, the Haynes Furniture Company occupied the left portion of the building and later enlarged the building in 1901. The addition included ornamentation at the top in the brickwork to match the original structure. Following the death of William Haynes in 1930, Haynes Furniture closed. The Swander Mattress Company in the neighboring building caught fire in 1962 and spread to the bottom left side of the historic building. After the fire, no one renovated it and the building stayed vacant until 2008. But that attempted remodel stalled until it was resumed in 2012 when Tin Man Brewing Company took over. Tin Man Brewing Company, a local brewery and restaurant, then occupied the building space. It has continued to improve and is now thriving as a successful brewery and family restaurant.